Hey guys, welcome back to Think Making. This is Anton, and today I'll show you how to use mesh bed leveling without the use of any probe. So let's get to it. If you've seen my previous videos about bed adhesion, then you might know bed leveling is very important. Just look at how this first layer looks without proper bed leveling and look how it might look after doing what I'm about to show you. So let me explain what we're about to do with this sheet of paper. So in traditional bed leveling, where you untighten or tighten the four screws in the corner, what you're actually doing is compensating for tilt in the bed. Mesh bed leveling is much better. It measures the height of nine or more points throughout the whole bed and then creates a virtual mesh structure, which it then uses to compensate not only for tilt, but also for curves and flex in your bed while printing, which is much better. Some printers have a probe that will do this automatically, but I will show you how to do it manually. To level your bed this way, I suggest to use the latest Marlin firmware for your printer and a small piece of paper. Start by making sure your nozzle is clean. Then go to your printer's menu and select prepare. Then you should see an option called level bed. If you don't have it, it might be disabled in your firmware. To enable it, head to your printer's firmware in your computer. Then open the marlin.ino file. Now press the configuration.h tab in the top bar. Then scroll down until you find a section called mesh bed leveling. To enable the feature, just uncomment define mesh bed leveling and define manual bed leveling. Next, upload the modified firmware to your printer. So back to the leveling process. When you select level bed, your printer will home itself and move to the first probing position. At this point, turning the knob next to the LCD screen will move the X carriage up or down. So go ahead and slip the piece of paper under the nozzle. Then move the nozzle to a height where it gets quite some grip on the paper. Then remove the paper. If you look closely, there should still be a small gap between the nozzle and the bed. When you're sure about the height, press the knob and the extruder will move to the next probing position. This process will be repeated nine times by default. When done, the printer will move back to its first probing position. Now we can start your print. I assure you this will get you perfect first layers without the need of a probe. I still suggest leveling your bed using the screws before trying this, as you will only need to do that once. Yet, the mesh bed leveling needs to be done every time you restart the printer. But don't worry, the menu option does not go away. It's just a leveling process with a piece of paper that you will need to do again. Yeah, it's a bit of a bummer, but it's not a deal breaker when you consider how perfect your first layers can be. Well guys, that's about all you need to know to get perfect first layers. If you found this video helpful, make sure you drop a huge like and subscribe to the channel. If you're feeling awesome today, you can also support my work through Patreon, or you could buy a cool t-shirt like this one in my merch store whose link is down below. As always guys, thanks for watching and see you in the next one.